friends, this is Jess from Knit Plan Jess. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. So we are doing another daily plan with me in my Franken Planner. Um, for my new viewers, welcome. I hope you enjoyed this video and for my returning viewers, welcome back. Um, I'm trying to kind of like every so often just do like a little flip through just to kind of show you how I have my Franken planner set up, just because I know that there's probably some people that this might be your first video watching of mine. And if so, thank you guys so much for joining me. Hit that subscribe button. Love you. Okay, so anyways, so I use the Happy Planner system. Um, I'm using the, I think they're, they're like a faux leather, faux wheat, faux, leather, vegan leather, but they have pockets and I really like the pockets. I don't really use the pockets for anything except just paper clipping little stuff to it. And then I have my name. I have my word of the year, a vision board from years ago that I just haven't taken out. And then we go into my daily planner section. And then I have my weekly planner. And then I have my social media. And then I just have an extra planner because sometimes I just like to decorate a planner just because. All right, so the purpose of this video, we are doing a daily plan, blah, 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 daily plan with me for July 27th and July 28th. We are going to use a Belle Fleur. I think I pronounced that right. I probably didn't. I'm also not French. I did take French in high school though. I took two years of it. And I don't think I really learned much. French is hard to learn, you guys. And then I'm also using Sage. I am really, okay, so I have the Happy Blooms because I'm wondering if some of these might work with the Sage sticker book, even if I was to just use like maybe the gold ones. I think that those might be pretty with it. Vinny's also really mad right now because I won't feed him. So anyways, I use the Happy Planner system because of the fact that the pages are on discs and it is super easy to remove them. So I can be able to take them off the disc when I want to um, like update my planner, when I want to decorate. Um, and I like it better than like the snap-in rings because I feel like that those break over time. So yeah, that's why I use it. All right, let's go ahead and start. My daily planner is basically anything in my life. Um, we are using the Belle Fleur sticker book first. This is a really pretty sticker book. Also, huge shout out to um, the Crafty Mom. I think I look, I think that's her right username. She's the one who suggested these books for this video. So I will link her Instagram below. Go check her out. Give her some love, you guys. She is like the sweetest person ever. All right. Now back on track. I am looking. I really like this one. And since we're using green and the, and this sticker in the sage, let's go with a pink and black spread. So I'm going to go ahead and white out the self-care and today's focus. I'm trying to actually limit what I white out each time. If I can cover something up with a paper sticker, I will. I feel like I'm using way too much white out. Okay, so wild and beautiful. I love that. And I want to use this one. I think that is super pretty. Let's root for each other and watch each other grow. And I want to also use, I'm looking for a header. Um, ooh, this is really pretty. That is super, super pretty. Okay, I am going to use I guess I could use like maybe one of these for a header. See, I didn't even need to white, I didn't even need to use white out on them. I am just gonna go ahead and use checklist from the Mojo Jojo Plans Check It Off book, mainly because I want to use black checklists and I don't know how many black checklists that I have in that book. So it's like, I might as well. So this is 
my last day of work before vacation. Um, it's okay. It's not really a vacation. It's a staycation. Um, we, I originally took this time off of work because we were going to try to go to Colorado to go see a baseball game, but flying from Northern California to Denver was looking at like five to $600 round trip per person. And then, um, actually hotels in Denver were looking at $300 a night. And I kind of realized that's, so <laughs> I basically wanted to cry at the price of that. So I decided that we, um, or we basically decided that we we're going to do a trip to, I like this one. Um, we're actually going to go to San Diego. So we were supposed to go to San Diego for a baseball game in 2020 and then COVID happened. So just FYI, if there is a humongous COVID outbreak that sends the whole country into quarantine, it is probably my fault again because we're trying San Diego again. <laughs> I'm really hopeful that it works out because I want to go see um, the Padre Stadium and um, we have tickets or we have like I have a hotel that is on um, Coronado and I'm so excited because we're like half a mile from the beach and yeah I'm just I'm so looking forward to that trip it's only for a few days but I'm really 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 looking forward to it okay so I'm also going to do this one with Let's do this today sticker. It kind of has like that lighter pink. That's really pretty. This is just going to be a super, super simple spread. Um, but I want to use some of these washi strips. I don't know why. I feel like I just need like some stickers down here maybe. And I don't know if I necessarily want to bring in a quote or if I even necessarily can be able to find a quote. So this will work instead. Actually, I'm going to use this, this silver, uh, the blip, this clear one. You guys, words are so freaking hard. <laughs> Gosh. I feel like I'm just waiting for the coffee to wake up and take effect. All right. Um, let's see. Is there anything else that I could like anything fun that I could really add? What if, like, I just want to add, okay, I don't know if this is, I don't know if this would even look right. Um, I'm trying to kind of decide, like, which angle do I want it to come, to come from? What if I was to put some florals alongside the checklist, and then I'm going to take my, um, my handy dandy little craft knife which by the way I realize that I'm not holding it properly but I'm also not talented enough to hold it properly and be able to use it I'm I realize with this I am horribly coordinated <laughs> I kind of really love that and then we're going to take one of these and I just want to just throw some flowers over that too does that look weird? That looks weird, but I don't care. Okay. Um, I will admit it's kind of a little, I feel like it's, I feel very limited in the colors that I chose, but it's okay. Um, this is also my last day. Oh, I could have used that one. That would be really pretty, but no, 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 it's okay. This is also my last day of work before my staycation. So is there like a weekend sticker I could use? Oh, I want to use these. I don't really know if there's going to be, a, if there's going to be like, yeah, I don't know, but I'm going to, there, I don't think that there is like really a good weekend sticker, but I'm going to kind of leave it just like this and just simple. I like it. All right. We are calling 
Belle Fleur done. And now I'm going to move on to July 28th with Sage. And maybe, maybe these florals. Oh, I really like this big page of florals. Okay, so the Sage sticker book, there is gold in here. So that already works perfect. Um, let's go ahead and start with this humongous floral sticker. Like, oh my gosh, look at that. That. Oh, I love it already. This makes me really, really happy. And I was even thinking um, about putting this up in the corner. Okay. Oh my gosh. This sticker has a mind of its own. All right. So this day I do have a doctor's appointment. Um, so I went to the allergist like a few weeks ago beginning of the end of June. Um, he actually had, like, the allergist was out with COVID, but they went ahead and did the test. Um, nothing came up as triggers, so I need to talk to him now because I still get allergy-like symptoms, but I, obviously I don't know why. Um, like, I don't know what's causing those allergy-like symptoms. So, at this point, I want to just kind of talk to him, see, like, I don't know. I mean, there's, I don't think there's really any other tests that can be done. Um, but it's more of just kind of finding, like, something to provide me relief. So then that way I don't feel miserable every single day. All right. We're going to do today's list. I kind of like this not using white out every single day. <laughs> and I am going to use these gold dots. Okay, sticker book, open up and stay open. I'm going to use these gold dots for during the week. All right, so, um, yeah, so I have an appointment with the allergist on the 28th um, because I had an appointment with him on whatever day that I went to get, get tested. Oh, it was June 28th and he ended, he was out sick for COVID. So they rescheduled or so they did the allergy test, but they rescheduled my actual appointment with him for the following week. He still had COVID. So they were going to reschedule it. And I just, I just told him, it's like, just go ahead. Let's set it for the end of July. I, that way I'm not going to have to try to figure out how to take off time from work. Um, especially since I already had time off coming up. I just really wanted to kind of keep it simple. So yeah, I have an appointment this morning, which is fine. I don't really mind doing something like that on this day. I'm going to enjoy having the time off. That's all that matters. I'm going to put that right there. And I want to put this right here too. I like, ooh, but I don't want to cover too much of these florals up. So I'm going to take this one first. Okay, this is going to go right here. Nope, that, 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 that's too crooked. You know what? No, I'm doing that. I'm doing that and then I'm doing this and then I'm gonna hopefully I can find something that will be like a box that I could put right above it that's kind of my intention um, in the, so my other plans for this day as of now I have no idea and I love not having any idea of what I want to do <laughs> it just it because I know that I could literally choose to do anything that I want this day. And that just feels good, too. All right, Duke is saying hi. I actually think that Duke is coming to be really, really sweet for me, or sweet to me, because he really probably wants food. He gets really, really nice whenever he is hungry. Um, oh, I need, like... Not that one. Okay. No, no. He's not even in the way. Never mind. I was about to yell at him and be like, Duke, you're in the way. 
Duke, now you're in the way. You're in the way of my paper. Okay, we're going to do Love Yourself. Oh, he didn't even come to give me headbutts. A butthead. All right. So, in other news, um, I, okay, so if you follow me on Instagram, you most likely have already seen this. Um, so, I watched a reel of someone making, um, they were making brown butter cookies. And this is the littlest things make me really excited, but I decided that I wanted, oh, anyways, I kind of got off track there. So as part of the reel, they used, um, they made their own butter for the brown butter cookies. And I was watching this reel and all I was thinking of is I want to make my own butter. So I did. And it, it turned out really, really, really well. But what I really like is that it also gave me buttermilk. And I don't buy buttermilk because of the fact that if I buy like a container of it, I don't use it all. So it tends to go bad. Um, so now that I actually have some buttermilk to use, I am going to plan on making like tonight. We're going to be doing just a really good breakfast for dinner. Um, I'm calling it a breakfast for dinner feast because of the fact that like we're doing sausage and eggs and bacon and homemade biscuits and um, maybe even waffles. And I think waffles would actually be really good to make um, just to have during the week as well. So. Yeah, I'm really actually really excited about making up that big old dinner. Um, that's what I'll be doing as soon as I'm done with this recording this video. So, okay, I really, really love how this is turning out. Thank you, Root, for suggesting this, this sticker book. Seriously, guys, go pay the go pay the crafty mom a visit on Instagram. Um, leave her like a message or a comment on one of her her post and let her know that I sent you like she I love the books that she recommended which I just realized I need to trim that off oh my goodness I think this is done oh hold on I almost forgot I almost forgot okay where's my sage I seriously am in love with this spread okay now I want to figure out which quote that I want to use. Um, I don't think I want to use gold up there. I've used a lot of gold. So let's go no gold this time. I like this one. I don't know if there's, I hope I'm going to have room for it. Okay, we're going complete white out. I will use my Uniball Signo white pen. This is one of my favorite white gel pens that I um, I like using for whiting out lines. And this is what I should be using instead of using white out. Because I use up a lot of white out when I do this circle. But I prefer these pens over the jelly roll. Um, although I do like the jelly roll because of the fact that this is, this is like a one millimeter tip. So it is a broad tip. Um, I do like the jelly roll for writing on um, like black paper or black headers or black accents because I'm not really a blackout spread kind of person. I know a lot of people are, but I'm just, I'm not. All right. Oh, okay. This makes me happy. And then I want to use the spread. This says all of your, or this spread, oh, I want to use a sticker that says all of your dreams are possible. There we go. Oh, I love this so much. Um, I kind of feel like I have this empty space right here. Can we do just breathe? I like it. We're good. Okay. 
And on that note, the spread is done. It is beautiful. It makes me really, really happy. And I'm really glad I was able to use the Happy Blooms. Okay, Duke's back. He's trying to look outside. And in order to look outside, he has to sit on my, or he has to be on my desk. All right, let's put this back into the planner. We only have three more days left to do of July. So next video you guys will see of my daily is going to be July 29th, 30th, and 31st. And then I'm so excited for August because that is my birthday month. But yeah, do stop drinking my coffee. Okay, so we have Happy Blooms and Sage for July 28th. I'm obsessed with this spread. I'm just obsessed with it. I love it so much. And then we have July 27th with Belle Floor. I love it. I love the simplicity. It's just, it's perfect. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe. Thank you guys so much. Um, yeah, I'll see you on the next video. Have a good day. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe and enjoy the next video.